Hello friend, welcome or oh, welcome back to Alien Nightmares 2 Let's Play. I have no idea if we are in episode 6 or episode 7. I don't, I don't know. I don't, I don't remember. So, we are stuck in this hospital without a little friend 6. Which, honestly, I don't mind because they were starting to freak me out. Uh, and now... We just crossed a very hard room and I hope we won't have to cross something that complicated again. Alright, let's keep going. I think I can go through there, but I want to visit a little bit first. Oh, I can go through several- Oh shit! No, I can't go through there! I should not go through there. My heart just stopped. I'm scared. Oh, okay. Okay, okay. Okay. No. The door. Oh, oh shit, shit. Is this going to be a hard room to cross again because I am terrified of those things? And I'm really not good with my flashlight. Why did you turn it off? Turn it back on. Okay. 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 Well, that was quick. You cannot catch a fucking break in that game, by the way. Like, let me breathe, let me have some creepy rooms, but without my heart beating so fast in my chest. And of course, I've got to do it all over again.
I'm trying to take my time a little bit more because I feel like rushing it is the reason why it's not working. I don't know. Thing I have a problem with depth. It's not just, uh, by the way, I don't even know if it's the right word that I'm using every time because I honestly felt like I was right in front of that door, and that's something that I feel in real life too. Where sometimes I'm just walking and I feel like I'm gonna fit through a door or through a space, and I don't, and I bump my shoulders into them, into it. I don't know. So I only still think that this is a problem with me because not now but the one before I was certain that I was gonna get through the door and my character just literally bumped into the wall it was it was they were that's better they were like so far away from that door faster under that bed. It's not possible. Like, I can't run under the bed, so... I don't know what sort of timing I'm supposed to have. Like, am I supposed to throw, slow them down with my light? Because, as we figured earlier, I'm not good with that. See, for me, that hand was very far away from me, but I feel like it wasn't, and I just, yeah, I think my brain is not cooperating today, any day, but today specifically. By the way, I'm shooting this episode, which I think is episode 7, but I've been shooting 4, 5, and 6 before that, so... I'm already impatient and 
everything. This is like almost half an episode where I've done nothing but struggle here. Let's try that again. Oh my god, I did it. Okay. Okay. Why do I feel like my problems are not over? Oh, soap! Where are in the showers? Okay. Don't you fucking dare move. Yeah. Sorry. This one scared me because I did not see it coming. Please don't move. Please don't move. Please don't move. I feel like his head is moving. It, its head is moving. Oh my god. Do I have to take the wheelchair? Please don't move. Please don't move. Okay. Doesn't seem to be wanting to do anything. What do I do? I can't climb up there. I feel like the wheelchair is something I'm supposed to grab. Can I push the door? I think I can push the door. Yeah. Okay, is there something I don't see? I don't want to go back there. Oh, the soap. Can I do something else with the soap? Thank you. <gasps> Ew. Disgusting. Another one of those. Okay, so it was just so I can find that. collect this level guys or something please the fly nose I hate the fly nose like the f fly noses flies noses I don't ha I don't know I'm losing my English right now am I supposed to take some soap and do something with it it's 
besides opening the door? Can I... There is to eat some soap, maybe. Like, is it the mannequin or dummy that is too heavy for me to push the wheelchair? Is that it? Can't I knock it off the wheelchair? Knock it out? Can I do something with this? Can I do something with anything? Mm -hmm. Can I move this? I don't want to climb it. I want to move it. I don't want to climb it. I want to move it. I can't move it. Can I move that? Can I can I do something with this, by the way? Like No. I can't take this any further. Alright. So, I just struggle real hard with a um, room filled with mannequins or dummies. I don't know how to what's the difference between a mannequin and a dummy. -ish. And now I'm stuck here. I'm pretty sure I gotta use the wheelchair. Pretty sure. Tell me that thing is moving its head. Please tell me I'm not losing my mind. Can't be just a matter of perspective, can it? I don't know. It's scaring the crap out of me. What am I supposed to do here? Something in there, can I grab that? Can I push? There's some sort of box here, I'm stuck. I can't see anything that is going on, so I'm pretty sure that's not it. It's a bucket, is it? What else can I do in here? Like, I can't really push that anymore, I think. Their soap is useless. There's... Hmm. Every time the dummies attacked me, they were in the dark. Yeah, because they're scared of my flashlight. Is it gonna... Is it gonna move? If I do this? Okay, okay, figured it out, figured it out. 
Uh, let's do. Let's let's let's. Ju, 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 ju. Stop moving. Stop. We we are done. He's gonna catch us. But. Ooh. Well, that was a closed one. Okay. Okay, so it's not specifically, specifically, specially, I don't know, it's not just the flashlight, it's light in general. Okay. So now, this thing is not too heavy and I can move it. Alright. I'm pretty sure you were behind your screen like, this is obvious, this is, how can you not understand it? Well, because I'm dumb. Ooh, it's dark in here. Know what it means? Dummies everywhere. Oh, there's one right here. Okay, okay. There's a lot of them. There's a lot of them. I am tired of the dummies. Really? Please, let's get out of here. I'm scared. Mommy, come pick me up. I'm scared. am I supposed to slow them all down? Like, they're coming from everywhere. Can I go here? Is it gonna make it easier if I do so? Now I'm stuck. Okay. It's not easier if I do so. I don't know.
I know that running through it doesn't seem like the smartest idea, but I really don't see how I can stop, like, there are five of them, I think? Five of them down? Like... And I think I see more moving in the background. I don't know if jumping is slowing me down or helping me avoiding them. Since I can't avoid them when I don't jump, I don't have a much comparison, you know? Yeah, I'm counting, f I'm counting five of them. I can't slow down five of them. I can barely do it when there's one of them. My question being, where the fuck is six when we need them? Like... I can't see what I'm doing. I can't see where I am. Okay. They also take an awful lot of time turning around. Like, is it just me or so I'm doing this and then do this, point out on something and then 
I don't know. Is it just me? Okay, so I'm pointing out. And then... Yeah, see that little frame... Frame... I don't know how to say that. Frame time? So, I am pointing the flashlight and then I'm turn around. Turn around. So when I want to run because I'm slowing down a lot of them like that, but then there's one of them behind me, so I'm like I'm going to let go and run. But there's this little time frame. Stop moving. Okay. Okay, I don't know what to do now. Let's just never move again. always it's always this one that caught me cat catch me catches me it's always this one that catches me because I'm trying to bundle all of them up so they can so I can handle them with my flashlight and then he sneaks out behind me see and grab me and I don't have time to turn around <clears throat> for the record I cut my mic a lot because I am swearing a lot in French right now because I am pissed and impatient and I feel like these episodes are not interesting to you guys because they are just annoying and just me struggling. I feel I feel strange about this gaming channel because I really like it. Like I like playing video games and I talk a lot when I play video games in general so why not filming it and putting it on YouTube and I love YouTube I've been doing YouTube for years now but I get so little interaction and it's just not me complaining I know that I know that um, this channel is very young it's barely three months old But having so little interaction makes me think that maybe I'm not doing the right thing. Maybe my 
videos are not worth it. Maybe I, I'm bad at it. Maybe people don't care. Maybe, you know, that sort of thing. So I, when I end up struggling a lot like that, I'm mostly annoyed, thinking, oh my god, am I gonna edit this out, am I gonna spit it out, uh, not spit it out, uh, spit the, the, you know, spit it, just spit it, <laughs> or am I gonna leave it, am I supposed to stay authentic and so that I struggle, am I supposed to cheat so you guys don't get annoyed that this is taking too long, am I supposed to, you know, th those sort of thing. So yeah, I'm pretty pissed at myself right now. I'm annoyed. Because I want to go through that room. And also, it's almost noon and I'm starving. It's almost lunch time. I'm really hungry. I always forget that this one is here because he's it's hiding behind other mannequins that do not move.
Oh my god, you can't be serious. Oh my god. I was there. And I... I stopped moving. Because I wanted to celebrate. And I got caught. Fuck. Thank <laughs> you. 
Oh my god, we did it. We fucking did it. Holy shit. Holy shit, I thought I was never gonna do it. So I'm gonna stop the episode right here. Because it's too fucking long. See you next time. Bye.